come on in come on in come on in I'm gonna wait for Facebook to build me an audience man it is a beautiful day I don't know about you but I'm just happy to be alive come on come on in I'm gonna wait on Facebook to build me an audience some of you may have had a long night last night but baby I'm up I'm blessed I'm happy today's message is let them laugh come on in begin to get tagged and share i must put this prophetic word in the atmosphere over your life listen i'm telling you i was just sitting in the salon and god began to speak to me i literally when i got done i jumped in the car and i had to jump on live because this was so much clarity i gotta prophesy into your life on today and it's up for you to receive it y'all know i can't get started until i feel like everyone who is on here is supposed to be on here so very quickly i need y'all to help me come on bombard heaven right now i got a prophetic word for you the one that's watching this video begin to hit share and tag quickly and swiftly the number is seven tag seven people you love seven people you care about seven people you want to motivate when i tell you when I release this prophetic word in your life, it's going to bless you on so many levels, man. Come on in and get tag and share. Get tag and share. Come on, 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 come on. When I was sitting in the chair just getting my hair done, when I tell you God just began to bless me. And as he spoke a prophetic word in my ear, while I was sitting there, you know, you sit in the salon and everybody be talking. Everybody be chilling. Everybody be doing their own thing. I heard people talking about Easter. I heard people talking about different things, their relationships. Ladies, y'all know how that is when you go into the salon. But baby, God began to speak into my ear and I began to tone out the noise, the outside voices. So if you will allow me to speak to you, the one that's watching this video, baby, I got a life-changing prophetic word for you. So for 120 more seconds, just two more minutes, I want you to tag and share like crazy come on come on very quickly very swiftly let them laugh let them laugh i don't know about you but baby i still got some doubters in my life i don't know about you but i run into people every day who feel i'm gonna stay stuck come on somebody in that level that almost broke me i don't know about you but baby i know i encounter people every day that smile in my face but really wish i was at the lowest point in my life the holy spirit told me to come and tell you today give you something pro uh, prophetic impart something pro uh, 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 prophetic in your soul in your spirit in your mind that is about to be life-changing baby i was on my way to the nail shop but i got to stop and come and talk to you the one that's watching this video and some of them they'll catch it a little bit later because you know they hung god so they sleep but the early bird get the worm can i prophesy to you today god told me to tell you yes you the one that's watching this video baby let them laugh they had no idea that that trip up was before your level up somebody ought to comment below laugh not cry later come on come on come on come on come on we're gonna do this very quickly we ain't gonna prolong this live i just need to prophesy something into your spirit today baby i don't want to prophesy to your soul allow me to prophesy to your spirit because baby when you got strength in the spiritual realm you can overcome demons i love you too bishop isaac when you got a strength in the spiritual realm you can step on the devil neck he told me to tell you baby let them laugh i don't know who lately been feeling like they coming up against me they laughing behind my back my own family wishing me uh wishing wishing my straw uh, wishing a struggle on me the people who's supposed to support me the most think i'm a laughing stock god said let them laugh they are so focused on your last trip up come on somebody that they about to be blinded by your level up i dare you to comment below i'm about to level up i'm about to level up i'm about to level up see it's something about when people already count you out it's something about uh when being the underdog is just in your bloodline it's something about when you ain't come from a silver-handed spoon it seems like everybody around you leveling up but it's taking you a little longer to get there because you doing it the right way somebody ought to comment below it's taking me a little longer it's taking me a little longer but i'm on the way god said let them laugh 
Let them laugh, baby. Let them misjudge you. Let them count you out. Let them think you are done. Let them see you crying. Let them see you when you're going through it. Let them see you in your uh, begging and borrowing stage. Let them see you in your, I ain't got it right now, but give me a minute stage. Because God said they are so focused on your trip up. They so focused on your slip up. They so focused on the lowest point you at right now. They so focused on that trip up. They about to be shocked by that level up. And God just, he began to bless me. He began to bless me. I started thinking about things. Oh God, I, oh, you ought to tag seven people you love real quick and say we finna level up. Because I always tell the people connected to me. Who you connected to, baby, it make the difference. Do you know that you can have favor just by who you connected to? I want you to tag your best friend, your homegirl, who you gonna club tonight with for Easter weekend. Tag your homeboys, your aunties, your grandmamas. Baby, we all finna come up because the favor that's on my life. It's your level up season. So he say, don't worry, let them laugh. Let them laugh. You ought to be putting some laughing emojis up right now. Come on, come on, let me see them laughing emojis emojis let them laugh baby i may be the laughing stock right now it's my life that's the laughing stock right now because my relationship ain't working out i don't know who i'm speaking to it's my life that's the laughing stock right now because you see me crying over things you've done to me you better hear what i'm saying it's my life that's the laughing stock right now because i ain't financially got it the way i had it before it's my life that's the laughing stock right now because i'm a little down and under the weather and a little sick in my body but baby god said let them laugh they so focused on the trip up come on they about to miss the level up what god is about to do in your life next you can't worry about who ha ha and kiki and what god is about to do in your life next you can't worry about who's sneaking inside this and what god is about to do in your life next you can't be focused on come on somebody all the bad days god say let them laugh now and cry later Listen, when I was in school, we used to say that all the time when we was younger. Laugh now and cry later. But when God just prophetically put that thing in my ear, it had me wanting to twist and shout. You better hear what I'm saying. You are walking into the best season of your life just because they decided to key, key, key. You are walking into the best. Can I prophesy to you? Yes, you the one that's watching this video. Baby, it's not by coincidence that you are on here right now. You are walking into the best season of your life because they decided that you were a joke. You are walking to the best season of your life because they tried to play on your top meaning. They tried to play with you. They thought you were lame. They thought Ooh, you better hear what I'm saying. There are some people who are assigned to your life just to mentally break you down. There are some demons assigned to your life just to have you disturbed and depressed. There are some demons assigned to your life just to break you and keep you moping. There are demons designed to your life to make you not want to get up again. But God said this season that he are putting you in. Baby, you need them to laugh. You you need them to key, key, key. You need them to smile in your face and all the time they want to take your place. You need them to talk about you like a dog. You need them to lie on your name. You need them to try to destroy you because that's what's going to keep their focus. You better get what I'm saying. I'm going to back that up because somebody might have missed it, baby. That's what's going to keep they focused. They so focused on your trip ups. They so focused on your mess ups. They so focused on your slip ups that they don't even know you about to level up. They don't even know this was a part of God's plan to make you look broke. This was a part of God's plan to make you go through the fire. This was a, ooh, you ought to comment below. This was a part of God's plan. Come on. I'm away. I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait until I see that all across the screen. Because the only way we can come in agreement, baby, the only way we can come on one accord for something great, for you, the one that's watching this video, baby, I ain't in your house. I can't high five you. I can't hold your hand and pray. But if you agree to the very things that I'm saying, you can comment below. You better hear what I'm saying to you. This season for you is about to be 
fire like never before. It's about to be consuming like never before. Baby, the favor on your life about to be so heavy that oil about to drip off on your bestie. That oil about to drip off on your husband and wife. That favor about to drip off on your kids. You better get what I'm saying. All because they laugh. They laughed at you and, and that, that, that sneaky, that, that messy laugh, come on somebody, almost made you react. But God said, you need them to ki ki ki. You need them to ha ha ha. You need them to have the biggest smile on their face about your downfall. But it's all just to detour them for what God is about to do next. It was in God's plan. Somebody ought to comment below. It was in God's plan, baby, if you got an iPhone. I know you're busy. Some of y'all trying to get cute for Easter, baby. And I know you're, you're running around trying to get all your kids matching outfits. I get it, baby. But, but, but I need you to just do me a favor. If you are an iPhone user, I need you to get ready to get screen record because baby we gonna put this prophecy in the inbox and on Facebook and on social media everywhere we gonna tag people in it baby that you are connected to don't tag your enemies in this season baby you ain't gotta tag the laughers why because let me tell you why God's about to show them what he's about to do for you but I want you to send this video to everybody you love I'm gonna count down from 10 and then I want you to get screen record because I'm believing that because of the favor that's on your life, you the one that's watching this video, and you might be saying, Evangelist, it ain't, you know my life ain't been looking like no type of favor in it. But what you don't know, crazy, is that's the way God works. He's so amazing, he'll even have you fooled. God about to do something big, so let's go ahead and count down. Can I prophesy to you before you go about your day? Somebody ought to comment below, prophesy, prophesy. Baby, if you are getting ready to receive this prophetic word, you ought to comment below, prophesy. So if you are an iPhone user, and baby, I want you to send that video to me when you're done recording. Please begin to record in 10, 9, 8. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. 7, 6, Five, four, baby, this blessing about to be so big for you. You got to send it to all the people you love. Four, three, two, one. Listen. You, the one that's watching this video, God told me it was all a detour. It was all a distraction. He wanted me to let you know, to let your haters laugh, to let the ones talking about you, come on somebody, let you be the, 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 the laughing stock. You have no idea that why they are kiki and keying and why they are ha 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 and, and why everything seems like a joke in your life. They are so focused on your trip. Ups. They are so focused on your slip ups. They are so focused on your mess ups that they didn't even know that God was getting ready to allow you to level up. You better hear what I'm saying. God said allow them to laugh. He had to take some things from you. He got to put you in that place you're in so we can show up and show out like never before. But the thing about baby when you getting ready to go to a comedy show. People got to pay you to make them laugh. You better get what I'm saying. God is saying he's getting ready to repay you for everything they use to keep them laughing. Like the fact that you might not have it right now. The fact that you may have been struggling. The fact that you may have been depressed. Maybe it was your relationship that they're laughing at. Maybe it's your children. Maybe it's the fact that you're homeless or that your car has been repo. I don't know what it is, baby, but they got to pay you for making them laugh. God say allow them to key 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 and allow them to ha 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 because he's about to do something so amazing. It's about to blow their mind. So while they were focused on your trip ups, God was getting ready to allow you to level up. I just want you to keep that in your spirit. You are about to experience some of the best days of your life. You shall lack nothing in this season because you was the laughing stock. You shall uh, 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 go forth You should have favor Favor with keys Favor with approvals Favor with man Just because you were a joke I just want you to know The one that's watching this video Baby You get what I'm saying Because they was focused on that trip up That last thing that almost took you out God about to make you level up Yeah I said it And then who's gonna be the joke then 
When you go to a comedy show, they pay the comedian to make them laugh. Yeah, you've been the laughing stock, but God said you about to get paid double for your trouble. Listen, people of God, I just wanted to jump on really quickly. I wanted to interrupt your day. Some of y'all was probably, I'll get you some Easter eggs and things for your kids to color the night, but baby, 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 why you out getting them eggs? Why you getting your hair done? Why you getting your cute little outfit? Why you doing how you do today, sis? Why you doing how you do today, bruh? You better look out for that big blessing. You been the laughing stock long enough. People don't understand that it's within your struggle that God can use you most. Why? Because he ain't looking for wimps. He ain't looking for people who can't take a hit. He ain't looking for people who, who, who you know, they, they, they break down every moment. Yeah, it's been a little harder for you. It seems like everybody around you prospering. It's just taking you a little longer to get there. Why? Because God doing something big. It's personal for God when it comes to your life. He got to show out on your behalf, man. Somebody ought to come and blow this personal, this personal, this personal, this personal. Come on. I want to see them laughing emojis. Ha, 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 baby. Key, key, key. Chuckle, chuckle, chuckle. It can all be funny, but baby, this next level up is about to apply pressure on their head. You about to level up. Level up. Level up. Five, four, three, three. Oh, listen, I'm too excited for you. What's the other say? Five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. Boom. Level up. Level up. You about to level up, sis. You about to level up, brother. I'm too excited because they was laughing. They was ha ha ha. All with the rest of them, ki 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 and chuckle, chuckle, chuckle. Didn't even know that God was finna show out on you. Let them laugh. They were so focused on your slip up. The fact that you slipped up again. Maybe some of you slipped up. You, you said, you know, I ain't gonna use again. I, I'm gonna put down the bottle. I, I don't care how much depression. Maybe you told your family and said, you know what? I ain't turning to drugs no more it, it, because I'm going through what I'm going through. Maybe you you said, I, I'll never get locked up again. Some of you, it might have been, I ain't gonna steal out the store again. I'm gonna I'm try to get a job. And then you failed. You tripped up. And it was funny to them because they already counted you out before giving you a chance. Maybe your trip up might have been the fact that you said, I'm done. He don't treat me good. No way. I ain't going back no more. I deserve better than that. But then you went back and you looked like the fool again. You, were, you was that laughing stock again. But they don't even understand that you about to level up on a whole nother level this time around. Oh, Jesus. On a whole nother level. Somebody ought to comment below on a, on a whole nother level. This level up is personal. It's personal because you've been the laughing stock all your life. Matter of fact, your mama and daddy was the laughing stock. Come on, who am I speaking to? This level up is personal. Why? Yo, your kids depend on this type of level up. God said, allow them to focus on the slip ups, the mess ups. Allow them to focus on the trip ups. So they can be distracted by the level up. Somebody ought to comment below. God, distract them. God, God, please distract them. Distract them. Oh, God, God, distract them. Allow them to keep laughing. Me and my husband, we went to see Marlon Wayne's last night at a comedy show. And when I was just getting my hair done inside the salon, the Holy Spirit, he said to me, he said, he said, he said, daughter. He said they were so focused on laughing at your trip ups and your slip ups. They didn't even realize it was a distraction for your level up. And I thought about it last night. We paid all that money to sit front row seats to see uh, uh, Marlon Wayans, the comedian, make us laugh. And some of you, your life has been a whole comedy show to people who never wanted you to win. You better hear what I'm saying to you spiritually right now. And some of you, your life has been a whole, whole, whole comedy show. To some people, but they are about to pay you for making them laugh. They are about to have to pay for counting you out because this level up is about to be personal. So I wanted to stop you in the middle of your day and tell you, let them chuckle. Chuckle, baby. Let them giggle. Let them laugh. Let them key, key, key. Let them ha, ha, ha. It's all a distraction 
for what God is about to do for you next. Listen, I can't get off without giving you the opportunity to sow. The number is bent to the bottom, people of God. I, 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 I listen, I want to listen very quickly. The number today is going to be 22. And the reason the number is 22, some of you are going to sow $22. Some of you are going to sow $122. Watch this. I don't want you to sow into my ministry unless God is telling you to right now. You know if you've been the laughing stock. You know if you've slipped and tripped and, 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 and did all kind of things. You know if they've been focused on your mess ups. And watch this. You need God to take you on a whole nother level to level up right now. You better get what I'm saying to you. I want you to go and sow the seed amount of $22 or $122. Come on, the information is bent to the bottom. In the, watch this, the memo section of your seed, I want you to put, I'm leveling up. I'm leveling up. Come on, come on, come on, very quickly. People of God, I see a lot of people jumping off and they going to sow. And it was already a lot of people sowing anyways. Because people watch me daily and they believe in my ministry. And thank you guys for believing in me. Shout out to everybody who sold their tithes and offering and stuff into me because they don't go to church. God is amazing. Thank you for choosing me. But right now, this seed that you're sowing, some of you are going to sow $40.22, but you better sow the number 22. Some of you is going to be $10.22. Some of you is going to be $1.22. Some of you, you're going to listen and sow the $22 or the $122. You need this level up to be personal. Some of you, you sowing because all your life you've been the laughing stock. Some of you, you sowing because you've been at the lowest point in your life. You better hear everything I'm saying to you. You've been at the lowest point in your life for so long. The way you say, I'm done. I'm done. You say, I'm done. God, I need you to do this for me. And the reason we're sowing the number two is because you've been through so much, baby. You need a double portion. I don't know who this is for. Somebody ought to comment below. I need a double portion. But I want you to put in the memo section. I want you to put in the memo section. This is for my level up. This thing got to begin to be personal for you, the one that's watching this video. Y'all was so focused on my slip-ups. You was focused on my mess-ups. Some of you, it wasn't even you that messed up. It could have been the person you in the relationship with, and you still the laughing stock. Some of you, it could have been your children, and you still the laughing stock. God said this next level up about to be personal. All the laughing, the kiki-kiing, the dragging on, the picking at you, they doing. They don't even realize that it's all a part of God's plans. So the seed amount is $22 or $122. Somebody say, Evangelist Shakira, I'm going to sow $44. I'm going to sow $66. I got to sow triple because I need this for me and my children. I got to sow triple because I need this for me, my husband, and my business. I got to sow triple. So you going to sow in the, in, in the in, uh, times three. Some of you going to sow $88 because it's four things you need God to do for you. But baby, I dare you to trust him. God may be saying, don't sow into um, Evangelist Shakira. Sow into your own church tomorrow. But I, I promise you this. You put that $22 seed in the ground and watch the, 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 the acceleration you walk into. Watch this next level up you walk into. God said, this time around, you're going to get the bigger portion. Because you've always been a joke to some people. Your life has always been a joke. But God said they were so focused on your slip-ups that they didn't even realize, here come your level up. They were so focused on your mess-ups that they didn't even realize God distracted them for your level up. That was a distraction. And the same way you got to pay to go to a comedy show for the comedian to make you laugh, they got to pay, pay for laughing at your life. I decree and declare a double portion. Some of you say, Evangelist Shakira, I ain't got it. You sold by tagging and sharing. God, no. He'll bless you anyways. Some of you say, Evangelist Shakira, I ain't got much. Come on. God said, you sow according to your own heart. But you got to put yes, yes. Cash app, Chime, Zelle, and PayPal. It's the phone number at the bottom. You got to type in the full number because there are so many fake 
cash apps they're making with my picture and all kind of stuff y'all don't type the whole number out you send it to the wrong person when you type in that number it should say dr shakira m type that number in on paypal cash app chime and sell listen i gotta go i love you guys god bless you guys let them kiki this level up this time about to be personal believe us